During university, I got very interested in algorithms and started writing creative code from scratch to visualize and test my understanding of what I'd been learning. Here are some of my sketches. This is just solving the towers of Hanoi problem and visualizing it. I can set the speed. This is just a 3D visualization of a graph. This is a steering behavior algorithm that finds places uh, according to a preset pattern. And this is a cool looking brush that uses Voronoi triangulation. This is a project I built from scratch in my sophomore year. So uh, as you may have already noticed, these are simulated beings trying to go for the green dots, which represent food and are avoiding the red dots, which are poison. The color of each being is indicative of their health and the circle around them indicates their perception radius. So I've let this run for a while and they have uh, learned some basic navigation skills by now, which is powered by reinforcement learning. I'm not using multi-engine reinforcement learning, uh, but I'm utilizing genetic algorithms to build dynamic populations of these organisms. They are inheriting both uh, positive qualities like speed and turning radius and are also inheriting negative qualities like immunity and health uh, from their parents. The health comes into picture when they meet at a particular coordinate, which uh, can result in a fight or reproduction or even death. The immunity here is depicted by a disease that overturns their affinity for food and avoidance for poison. And the pathology is depicted by the ones that have turned black. So I can also influence the availability of food and the prevalence of the disease and also influence if uh, the fittest or the weakest are cloned. So there's a lot that is going on here. And uh, I've also plotted the basic metrics. And as we can see, the overall health of the maximum person is increasing and the average speed of the population is also increasing. Even the entire population size has been increasing and uh, that is indicative of, uh, of an abundant period in this simulation.